Crosses Street. At the end of the street, to the right, is Jimenez de Enciso Street. We will enter, passing in front of the Jewish Interpretation Center. We continue a little further on, passing by Atablao Flamenco, and on the first street on the right, we will see a facade with two embedded wooden crosses. This is Crosses Street. What do these crosses on the facade mean? Well, in the Santa Cruz neighborhood at that time, it was very common for people to pass by the taverns. Drinkers, rogues, quarrelsome night owls, and in general, people living the nightlife. These individuals, after passing through the taverns, which were very abundant in the area, needed to drain their bladders in any narrow alley where there were no lamps nearby. This left bad smells and deterioration on the poorly whitewashed facades. That is why someone came up with the idea of giving it a certain religious aspect and appealing to the Holy Father so that drinkers would sin elsewhere. That is, unload their bladders away from the crosses. We enter the street until we reach an extension where we will see a calvary that is, three stone columns crowned by wrought iron crosses. Everything sits on a brick pedestal and it's closed by a fence with lanterns at the corners. This view is really impressive at night. Behind this calvary, a little to the left, is Marshall Street, which joins the Refiner's Plaza with Maiden's Street. It is 101 centimeters wide at its narrowest part, which makes it the narrowest street in all of Seville. It owes its name to Marshal Diego Caballero, but it previously received different names, such as Trasbolsa, in the 16th century due to its proximity to a bank. When we cross this street, we come across the Refiner's Plaza. Refiner's Plaza. In this plaza, we find the statue of Don Juan Tenorio. Don Juan Tenorio is the archetypal character of Spanish literature, created by Tirso de Molina in The Trickster of Seville and idealized by the playwright Zorrilla as Don Juan Tenorio. He is the protagonist of the Refiner's Plaza. The passersby look for him and stop to read the inscriptions at the base of his statue. In them, passages of the literature are reflected. For example, From the haughty princess, the one who fishes in a mean boat, there is no female to whom she does not subscribe, and she covers any company if it is based on gold or value. On the other hand, look for the fighters, close the players, whoever lends themselves to stop him, to see if there is someone who surpasses him in game, in fight, and in love. It must be said that the name Refiner's Plaza has to do with a guild of people who were dedicated to working with leather. Normally, those who work with leather are located on the outskirts or near the city walls to avoid the bad smell produced when leather is treated.